I am come today with First Welton Brownies, I'm the leader, the Snowy Owl, but I also represent um, as dis District Amateur District Commissioner with the Girl Guide, so it's the Rainbows, the Guides, the Brownies, the Senior Section and the Leaders as well. We came last year, um, for the um, we had some big funding and um, we went on a big 100th birthday camp called Cosmic. Um, which we got funding for and this year we're going doing a, something similar but on a little bit smaller scale with the rainbows so I just wanted to check the information I've received last time was still current and also there was different presentation to see whether I could pick up anything else. Representing the Demetri Motorcycle Festival. And what was your reason for coming here today? Well, basically funding and any voluntary volunteers that we can get. My name is Peter Northway and I represent Safa Forces Health, that soldiers, sailors, airmen's families association. It's existed since 1885 in Northampton and we're the oldest community charity. Um, but all our caseworkers are, are volunteers and my job as the fundraising awareness manager is to basically fund their expenses. I'm John Wilshire, I'm representing Weedon Village Hall. I am looking to make our Village Hall DDA compliant. Uh, I need to put in better access doors, I need to put in an induction loop, and I don't know where to go for the money. And have you found today useful? Oh, very, very useful. Yes, yes, I've got two or three leads, two or three leads, which I shall now go back and work on. I've already put an application in to the NCF to raise uh, money to create a recruitment drive to raise 10 more caseworkers in the next 12 months. But I've also had a very useful contact here with Damage District Housing because most of our workers uh, are working within uh, that sector and we're looking at trying to recoup our expenses. So with the marshalling, which I mentioned, that can be really expensive if you have to sort of find marshals in to do it. I mean, um, you can get like the younger ones to do it, like the cadets and that sort of thing, but you've got, it's quite a responsible job, so you can't really take risks with that sort of thing, so we, we may have to pay for that. But I, I've been to a couple of the ladies, you know, with the volunteer, who think that they may be able to help. Maybe not this year, but next year. It's the first time I've actually done anything like this. I've not really been, not really into fundraising. But it's, um, it's a sort of bit of an adventure for me, but if you need to do it, then you do. So I think the event's been great. There's loads of information, and, you know, and I spend on that. So I think it's been good. Um, I managed to have a chat with some of the people on the desk and sort of put what I wanted down and also in the pack there was a sheet with lots of smaller fundraising ideas so I'll show you putting some of those into practice as well so overall really good.